Alright, how you doing? My name's Dirk. I'm the guy that's going to show you how to set this Teton cot up. It's one of the baddest cots on the market. It comes in a nice tough bag right here with some straps. There's some, there's some Velcro pads right here that you can open it up with. It weighs about 25 pounds. Easy to mount. What I do is just open it up at the top. Take these two bars out. These are going to be your end bars. Stand it up on his head like this and just pull the cap back. Really easy. You can get the rest up. Just lift it right out. That's it. It's easy as that. So if you get it on his feet, whoops. Get it on his feet like this where the rubber feet are on the, on the floor. Then you just open up one leg at a time and you can actually just let the whole thing fall out like this. One, one side down and the other side down. Or what's even easier, because if you don't have a lot of space, People are always having trouble with this thing because they don't have a lot of space. So what I do is I take, I just keep it folded up like this, right? This is the way it's gonna look like coming out of the bag. And I'll just grab it like this and just lift up this foot, and lift up this foot like this, and then grab it up at the top and kind of swing it in and let it out. That way you have all three legs on the same side and you don't need as much room to set it up. So I'm gonna move this lamp a little bit over here so I don't smack it. And then you just lay it down like this. Pull it open. Make sure the legs are out. Pull it open, you see how wide it is? That's 40 inches by 85 like a full-size bed. Awesome. So, and then you take your head, your head pole, you got two poles. One of them has a red dot on it right here. And I'm going to give you a close-up of this, but this is just a wide angle shot right now. So, you go into the first, under the head, and you have a hole here for each, for each connector. And you just connect this on but first you pass it through this slip on the cot. And once you get it through the slip, you can actually put it You gotta make sure your cot's got some leeway on it. You can actually put one side in here and then you pull some leeway you get the other side right here. You have your head piece on. And then for the tail piece, there's a red, red button side, which is gonna be necessary to get the leverage device that's gonna actually help you get it together. So you slip it into the slip, like this. And you put this side on first. So you pull it toward you and get this side on first. And then, this one over here is, this is where you're gonna need some leverage. So we have this little red leverage bar that they actually mounted on the machine so that you could actually use this. And underneath this pole, there's a little place for that thing to fit inside before you use it. So it actually moves fairly easy. You put it in here, and all you have to do is lay it in the hole and then push down on it and click, you've got your cock. So you can put covers on it. I'm gonna put it up like this so you can see it. You've got all this space to sleep on. Put a cover on it or a sleeping bag, a couple of covers if you want something underneath you. Sleep like a dream on this thing. I slept on it when I first got it for a couple of days to make sure it was the best buy I ever made. Thanks for listening, and I'll show you how to take it apart in just a minute.
Okay, now I'm going to show you how to take apart the Teton cot. And if you'll just pop these out. There's one side. Pop these out. Here's the other side. Fold it together. Lay it on its side. So that you have all three legs up in the air. Then you bring this one up to the middle. Let it fold down. Watch your fingers so you don't get them squished. Bring this one up. Let it fold down. There you go. Ready to be packaged up. So the way you package it up is Take the bag like this, and you come over the top, get it good and snug on there, and you flip it over, and you take this side, you slip it over the top, and then turn it to the side. And then you can attach the Velcro like this. Oh, actually, I need to put these in there first. <laughs> so once you get these inside, right on top, you can just attach the Velcro. Makes it quite snug. And then put it away in your closet and you're ready for next time. Thank you.